What is going on everybody? Thank you so much for tuning in. My name is John. Today I have for you a convenience good. That's right, today we're going to be taking a look at the Lamacall phone stand for MagSafe charger I picked up using Amazon Prime for $19.99. Out of five stars, this MagSafe charger phone stand gets five out of five stars out of 232 customer reviews. Today we're going to be doing an unboxing and a first impression. So we're going to set this up. We're going to see how well it works. One thing I quickly want to point out is this charging stand does come in a silver aluminum color. So even though this was just a little bit more expensive, uh, this one actually has some design features that I will point out once we do the unboxing and first impressions that I think just uh, really make this look like an Apple OEM product. But uh, if you do want this in a different color, because this one only comes in silver, uh, you can actually find other stands similar to this one. They don't seem like they're as good of quality and they're actually just a little bit cheaper. I think they're about $9.95 and they come in a couple different colors. I'll go ahead and leave a link to that stand below. But this one, I think, even though it only comes in silver, I think it has some features that, like I said, make it look like an Apple OEM uh, MagSafe stand. Uh, the reason why I went for this Lamacall stand compared to the other stands was because, like I said, the build quality looked so much better. There's no tape or anything, but as you can see on the top of the box here, we do get a user guide there. It will pretty much tell you probably how you can adjust it and that you do have to, in fact, buy MagSafe with it. But this is definitely a brand I would go with. Uh, you get the charging stand on the top there. We'll get to that in just a second. Get some foam pieces here. And then at the very bottom of the box here, you get another aluminum piece. It's actually the base of the stand here. And actually what's really important, what I actually really wanna mention here and note is this is exceptionally well weighted. This is a very nice, uh, if I threw this at you, uh, I would injure you. This is a very nice heavy weighted aluminum piece. It's like an anodized aluminum, very similar to what you'll find on a MacBook Air or Pro or iMac, for example. Uh, this opening here, I don't believe is functional. It's just a design aspect of it. Uh, maybe you can run a wire through that, not sure, but uh, the way it's looking, I think it's just for design wise. We'll take a look at that later, but you can see at the bottom of the base here, you do get a Lamacall uh, logo. Not too big of a deal. A little bit frustrated at that, but Again, what makes this a non-OEM Apple MagSafe stand is the fact that you do get, you know, third-party branding in places that doesn't really look all that great. But, and actually, I think you may have noticed this already, but you do get a little Allen key and just a couple of screws in the box and a little plastic baggie here. So you get two screws and an Allen key. And then last but not least, uh, you do get the stand itself here. So it actually comes folded flat, but it is the same uh, sort of precision anodized aluminum look and feel and weight as the base, which is really good to see. This is a really nice, well-made, sturdy product. And actually what's really nice about this stand is you can adjust it pretty much any way. It doesn't lock in anywhere. It just pretty much stays put within the 180 degree envelope. So there is no give whatsoever. And I expect it to be the same once I get the phone on there. It feels extremely tight and well put together. Okay, so one thing I quickly wanna point out here before we get this set up and working is how to insert the stand. Now, uh, right off the bat, I think you're gonna be uh, pretty much wondering, will it go in forward or will it go in sort of aft like we have it now. If we actually just take a look at the user manual here, you can pretty much see uh, that the stand is facing forward here. And then that way, once you do pivot this cradle uh, vertically 90 degrees with the phone right side up, uh, you can actually run the cable for the MagSafe through this back opening here and then up into the bottom of your iPhone. So I think the best way to probably go about this here is to just lay the cradle face down and then position the stand vertically here. And as you can see, I'm actually trying to get this uh, screw in even tighter, but it's pretty much as tight as it can go. Uh, so far, what I absolutely adore about this stand is everything here is so precise and everything fits 
so snugly from the uh, stand in the base to the MagSafe puck in this cradle here to just putting the screw in. And then actually what you'll want to do is, what's really nice is you can pretty much just run this cable here right through the back of the stand here. And we'll go ahead and just plug it into our charger there. And that's pretty much it. This is super clean. We'll go ahead and just attach the iPhone there. And then you can see we are getting a charge indicator, which is fantastic. So. Uh, let's actually just maybe see how easy this is to adjust here. Uh, the phone is maybe just a little bit off axis there. It's not perfectly vertical, but that's really not a big deal. If you want to uh, adjust it, you'll pretty much have to, I think what you'll actually want to do is probably uh, have the stand positioned the way you want it. And then when you walk up to it, then you can attach your iPhone to it. Uh, I can pretty much just unlock my phone. I can take phone calls. I can take FaceTime calls with it. Uh, one thing I actually want to point out is it actually connects directly over the Apple logo here. So uh, just remember where the Apple logo is and that way you can pretty much get it right on spot every time. So like I said, just remember the Apple logo is at the center of the phone and that's where MagSafe will connect. And as you can see, it does a great job of holding the phone horizontally. Okay, so what I absolutely love about this stand is it is very Apple-esque. Uh, you have this uh, opening through the back that you can run the wire through just like an iMac. And last but not least, I think you'll notice this here. Look at this little screw that, you know, keeps the hinge tight here. It actually is kind of a polished, shiny look to it. It almost looks like it belongs on an Apple product itself or came right off an Apple product. Maybe a little bit of an older Apple product, but an Apple product nonetheless. So anyways, guys, that has been an unboxing and first impressions and setup of the Lamacall phone stand for MagSafe charger. I picked up using Amazon Prime for $19.99. Out of five stars, this MagSafe phone stand gets five out of five out of 231 customer reviews. I can absolutely positively see how it gets such a positive uh, reception and rating uh, from the build quality uh, to the way that it went together so seamlessly uh, to just how well it works and functions and the way it looks, uh, it definitely gets a five out of five from me. Uh, it's also a really nicely weighted product. Uh, the base is a very heavy, durable anodized aluminum and as you saw earlier it has all rubber underneath it so it's not just a couple little rubber bits in the corner of the base it's entirely rubber underneath so you're not going to worry about this uh, falling flat on its face and damaging your phone for example i'll go ahead and leave a link in the description below to this product i'll also leave a link to a couple of other less expensive stands that i have not reviewed but don't think will be as good as this stand. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for tuning in. I really hope you enjoyed this unboxing and first impressions. If you want to see more content like this, hit that like button, subscribe. Also, before you do that, go ahead and check out our merchandise store. I'm thinking about doing some custom clothing, like uh, maybe uh, hot stamping, lettering down to these shirts, or maybe even doing tie-dye shirts, or actually even both tie-dye and stamping lettering down. Uh, it would be these quotes. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for tuning in. Like I said, hit that like, subscribe. My name is John. Thanks again for watching. I will see you in the next one.